Today we'll be having a look at the Red Arc 40 amp fuse kit for Red Arc in vehicle DC to DC battery chargers, part number 331-FK40. This fuse kit is a great solution when you need to fuse a power wire such as this six gauge power wire. You may need to use this if you're using a battery charger on a trailer, which is what we're gonna be using it for, or if you're using it for a winch, or if you're using it for a salt spreader on the back of a plow truck, or whatever other application you're using it with. In our particular case, we're using six gauge wire going into it. The terminals that come with it will crimp onto six gauge wire very nicely. This kit will come with two fuse holders and four fuses, so you have two replacement fuses if you ever would happen to blow one. We also have four ring terminals, so you can actually install both fuse holders appropriately. Now the reason you're going to want this over other fuse options on the market is that this comes with everything you need in order to properly get a fuse set up on a wire such as this six gauge wire. The reason you want to have a fuse installed is because if you were to have a short circuit, you don't have to worry about an electrical fire happening in your trailer, your vehicle, or damaging your piece of equipment that's being powered by this. The fuse will blow, thus eliminating the risk of an electrical fire or causing damage to your expensive devices. Now the fuses that come with this kit are rated up to 40 amps. So if you were to have a draw over 40 amps, the fuse would then blow and then will protect the system. If you're running less than 40 amps of current on your device, this will be a perfect solution for you. Inside of our fuse holder, you can find our 40 amp fuse. It's easily replaceable with one of the included replacements if you were to need to or have to replace it. You don't have to worry about running to an auto parts store in order to get a replacement. You'll already have it, so you're safe for the future. Now that we've gone over some features, we'll show you how to get it installed. Okay, as you can see here, we have a power wire in the engine compartment of our vehicle. And in order to hook this up to our battery, we need to make sure that we have a fuse to protect the circuit that this wire is going to power. Now we're going to cut off some insulation from all three ends of our wire. Just using a utility knife to do this. If you have wire strippers that are big enough to do this, that's good. I don't, so I'm just using a utility knife. Okay, now that we have it cut, we'll pull off the end. And we'll twist the wire together nice and tight. And we'll do the same for the other two ends. Now we'll take one of our ring terminals that comes with our kit and we'll stick it on the long end of our cable. We'll stick it down all the way and we'll crimp it into place. We're using a hydraulic crimper for this. These are readily available at most hardware stores. We did the same for one of the other ends of our short cable. Now on the other end of our short cable, since we're using six gauge wire, we're going to attach a six gauge ring terminal with a 3 8 of an inch diameter hole, part number SWC57016 on our website. And we'll use our same crimping tool to crimp that into place. Red Arc does highly recommend that we solder. I will go ahead and get some solder inside of there. Okay, now that our connection is soldered, we'll have a great electrical connection that's nice and solid. We'll take some heat shrink and we'll cover up our solder joint and our cable. And we'll use a heat gun to shrink it down. And we'll repeat the same process of soldering and heat shrinking all of our connections from this point forward. Now we'll take our fuse holder, we'll move the nuts, we'll 
take our provided 40 amp fuse, place it over the studs, and we'll place our terminals over the studs and reinstall the nuts. And we'll use an eight millimeter socket to tighten our nuts. Now we'll take our cover and we'll fold it over our connections and it'll snap close and lock into place. Now we'll remove this nut on our positive battery post. Place our ring terminal over the stud and we'll reinstall the nut. And that completes our look at an installation of the Red Arc 40 amp fuse kit for Red Arc in vehicle DC to DC battery chargers, part number 331 FK. Thanks for watching and click the link in our description below to shop, learn more, or visit us at eTrailer.com. And leave us a comment if you have any questions.